Welcome today to the 2124 Lofts on East 5th Street. This is Charles Runnels with Presidio Group. This is a property marketed by Debbie Barrera in my same office, Presidio Group. You can find her information right here. This is a property for lease. Debbie Barrera, DebbieKnowsAustin.com. Great condo community. The one we're about to look at is three stories. Uh, it's actually kind of a two-bedroom loft with one and a half bath. Uh, as you can see, the buildings down there is downtown. Really close to Progress Coffee, Nueva Leon is right about a half a block away. And the new Saltillo train station is going to be right here at this place. Um, some of you may have concerns that that would actually create a lot of noise, but you'll see that all the windows inside this loft are actually pillows, so they are pretty sound resistant to things like trains and pedestrians and whatever else. Let's go take a look at the condo. Got a ground, ground entry. Stairs right here lead up into the kitchen and living room. Back here, is it all your own for storage, bikes, there's a closet right there, and then your own private entry into the gated part where the cars are parked. There's actually two reserve spots that come with this property. I believe they're both covered as well. Here's one of the gates. There's the trash and recycling. It's actually a really, really great area over here. Got some kind of festival lights, and there's a there's a couple of grills over here and a picnic table. Um, very, very community oriented community. A lot of xeriscapes. Got some palm trees here. A lot of bamboo. Very tastefully done. And kind of a center courtyard, um, landscaped, landscaped quite well. It's all pretty much surrounding this courtyard, um, which is a nice little green space in the urban jungle that we live in. Let's go back this way to go back into the loft. You're extremely close to all of the new stuff that's over on East 6th Street, like the Good Night, East Side Showroom, Shangri-La, a lot of lounges, bars, Buenos Aires, Argentina restaurant that started over on the south side. And let's walk up the stairs. Great window waiting for us. Great ironwork. And then up here, sort of a, a, a metallic concrete floor. It's going to be really hard to pick up in video. But this is kind of your great room. You've got a great center island with beautiful granite, light hardwoods, stainless appliances, full refrigerator, everything from a dishwasher, microwave oven, all of this is included. This is actually a very smartly laid out room because if you don't really have a dining room table or don't want to have a dining room table, this island will basically suffice. Right here to the left is the, long, the washer dryer hookups and then I wish you could see this a little bit better but this is a half bath. Pretty simple, pretty modern. Gets the job done when your friends are over watching a game or the Oscars or whatever you're into. This is actually a shelf that's been installed for um, overhead projector. There's actually a projector. You know, there's a lot of wall space here to put a projector if you'd like that. And again, I think you could probably hear the difference in the sound between open and close. Of course, I've got other windows open in the background, so that might not be that evident. Um, one of the things that a lot of east side properties are lacking is sound protection. Here's a view. Got Houston Tollitson over there. 
and downtown. I think that's the Hilton right there that we're actually looking at, but extremely close. Good night. I mean, you could walk easily, 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 easily. And then down below, I don't think you really noticed it much. There are a lot of businesses. There's a acupuncture business and a couple of creative businesses that house right here in the Saltillo. And a great view. There's actually ceiling fans in all the rooms and these open trusses. Beautiful Pella window waiting for us. And this is kind of just a very open area. It might not be ideal for certain roommate situations because as you see, this is a bedroom here and then this is kind of a bedroom slash office. You know, just really kind of a separate space. Uh, let you use your creativity. Closet here and then actually a nice little nice little window here that you know, nobody is looking in because this is actually the end unit. And a couple of these windows actually upstairs are operable. Love this loft area. And then, of course, you got some very industrial lights, travertine, backsplash, the granite, and these really cool modern faucets, and of course, the garden tub. Pretty easy to see, very simple white tile. And then the walk-in closet. And there is a pocket door right here to um, close up. Keep everybody from snooping through your stuff. And then of course this is just kind of a great area for an office. And these are beautiful. I think these are actually pine floors. Not a hundred percent, but they look really, really beautiful against these white walls. Um, and again, another ceiling fan. And this actually is another one of the operable windows here. A lot of pedestrian traffic through South Fifth. So if you really want to be connected to, you know, downtown and what the east side has to offer, you know, even if you worked up north, the metro rail, at least what they're telling us is it's going to be in high gear. Um, in March, which March is coming up very quickly. In fact, I think March starts Monday, but I'm not sure what date it is. But you know, just a great way to be connected. You know, a great place to park a scooter, walk places, scooter places, bicycle places, but also a place for your car. And just easy access to every part of Austin, really. So this concludes our little tour of the Saltillo Lofts. Um, I don't believe there's any for sale right now, but you can reach me at area code 512-914-0183. But if you're interested in this property, it is being marketed by Debbie Barrera, one of my colleagues at DebbieKnowsAustin.com, and her telephone number is 203-1912. And I was about to say, there actually are a um, few places, commercial spaces for lease in here as well but to my knowledge i think this may be the only lease available so if you're interested let us know and we'll be happy to give you a tour